you're on a maintenance chemo drug, but you know, I'd like to get a second opinion from somebody. I'm aware of another treatment. Let's try something different. You know, if that's happened with one of our clients, all of a sudden we take them out of network, have a conversation with the HR director to go out of network, um, costs a little bit more, but a surgical removal, an ablation of the, of the spots. And all of a sudden this individual is in remission as opposed to being, you know, high level of cost. We're talking about three to $500,000 a year in terms of this chemo maintenance that's just waiting for this person to die when there was a cure available, but nobody was aware of it within the system that we were in. So finding oh. those things, there's just, there's just that when you have access to expertise, you don't have to make the experts do the work, but they can point you in the right direction to help us advise our clients, you know, to find, hey, here's a unique solution for this. You may not be on top of this, but if you talk to this and go to this person, they're going to be able to do something else. We had another one where somebody was going to go to uh, a regular orthopedic surgeon, pretty good orthopedic surgeon for uh, a cervical spine issue. Um, that actually needed to be microsurgery. I mean, very, very complex, would have ended up with a lot of complications, probably had a, you know, 50-50 chance of being paralyzed by the, yeah, by the uh, uh, orthopod. Um, got him into this expert. We called our, our contact, um, who's chief of surgery at Emory, found out who would do it in the, in the southeastern Wisconsin area, went to Madison, found a great guy. Um, and this person basically was even off pain meds within two weeks. You know, unbelievable results, right?